James Outram Fraser, cum laude. He gave up a promising career and potential fame. He traveled around the world and lived among them, working alone most of the time. He learned their language, created a writing system, preached the good news, and translated scriptures. But after six years, relatively few people were interested, and no church had been formed, even with a tremendous prayer of faith in recent months. And Fraser had an invitation to serve elsewhere. Perhaps this is not God's time. Is it right for me to stay on, waiting and praying, when workers are urgently needed in more fruitful fields? What happened to James O'Fraser and the Lee Sioux people will surprise and inspire you.